He just got a perm. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to do a proper taper haircut with the curls. We're gonna make him look sexy. From the top. Like half an inch. That's huge, bro. Half an inch is pretty huge. We'll do half an inch on top. Always listen to what your client wants. I want you. <laughs> Mid blowout taper? Yeah. Fuck, that shit nasty, dog. Ew. You know, we're sectioning off the top. How long ago did you get your perm? A month ago. If you're trying to get a perm, I recommend getting it before you get a haircut. So the people who are doing the perm have the most amount of hair to work with. We have like the same curls right now. All sectioned off. You welcome with the number four. The clipper over comb. Now I'm starting to taper. If you want to see the entire details, I'm not going to go through it super in depth because I do it every time. Just check the video pinned on my profile. It is a fade video, but the method is the same. I'm just concentrating on the sideburns and back instead of like going through the whole head. The guidelines are really the only difference. With that said, I'm starting with the number two and I'm just going to montage this taper up. The one thing to note though that's different about this haircut, it's a blowout taper. So I'm trying to leave as much bulk. So I am flicking everything out as much as I can. Making my one and only guideline with the number one close. Then we're just gonna fade down from there. In the last video, I said there are two aspects of fading. Individual hairs being blended from short to long, and then the color aspect of where you might have some dark spots. But there's a third aspect when you're doing a blowout taper, and that's how it looks, this part right here. You need to make sure that you can see the hair just being blended out like this, and there are no like clumps of hair showing. You really have to be good with your clippers, freehanding, and then just using clipper over comb. All right, we split the hair down the middle. He looks handsome. Since his hair is curly, it's going to shrink up. You would think that I would cut all this length off to match it to this guideline right here, but since it's going to curl up, I'm not gonna do that. I'm only gonna take about half of it off. So when it curls up, it's gonna appear blended. Some overhang here, I can get rid of it. Yeah, low key, I'm trying to get rid of the overhang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. 